Live Long and Prosper, Happiness Comes from Within by Michael McNaught Introduction In the relentless pursuit of happiness, we often find ourselves embroiled in an endless chase for external validations, possessions and milestones. Society tells us that happiness is a destination, one that can be reached through the acquisition of the largest gadgets, career advancements, or even through the number of likes on social media. Yet, in this constant search outside of ourselves, we overlook the profound truth that has been echoed by sages and philosophers throughout the ages. True contentment originates from within. This realization often dawns not amidst joyous achievements or in the accumulation of material wealth, but in moments of quiet reflection, when the noise of the world fades away and we are left alone with our thoughts. It is then that we understand the fleeting nature of external pleasures and the enduring power of inner peace. This insight is akin to uncovering a hidden treasure within ourselves, one that no external circumstance can diminish or enhance. Imagine standing atop a mountain, breathing in the vastness of the world below and realizing that the beauty of the universe can also be found within the depths of your own soul. Just as the mountain has weathered storms and basks in the warmth of the sun, our inner selves possess an incredible resilience and capacity for joy that is not dependent on external factors. The key to unlocking the state of bliss lies in cultivating a mindset of gratitude, engaging in practices that foster mindfulness and nurturing a deep connection within oneself. The journey to inner happiness is both simple and complex. It involves peeling away the layers of societal expectations and personal insecurities to reveal our authentic selves. It requires us to be brave enough to face our fears, to embrace our imperfections, and to find contentment in the present moment, regardless of our circumstances. This path is not about rejecting the external world, but about finding a balance where our inner peace becomes the foundation upon which our external experiences are built. True happiness, then, is not a pursuit, but a practice, a daily commitment to fostering the qualities within us that lead to lasting contentment. It is about making the choice to water the garden of our minds with positive thoughts, to nourish our spirits with meaningful connections, and to eliminate our path with the light of self-awareness. When we embark on this inward journey, we discover that happiness is not a distant land to be reached, but a flourishing landscape that exists within us, waiting to be explored and cherished. As we navigate through life's ups and downs, let us remember that the most profound joy comes not from what we gather from the world, but from what we cultivate within ourselves. In the end, the pursuit of happiness leads us back to where we started, to the heart of our being, where true contentment has been residing all along, quietly waiting for us to notice. Happiness is multifaceted. Happiness, often thought as a singular state of bliss, is in reality a multifaceted experience that encompasses the entirety of our mental, emotional, and intellectual well-being. This broader understanding invites us to explore happiness not as a one-dimensional feeling, but as a rich tapestry of experiences that contribute to our overall sense of fulfillment and contentment. Mentally, happiness involves a state of balance where stress and anxiety are managed and positive thoughts predominate. It's about cultivating a mindset that fosters resilience, allowing us to navigate life's challenges with grace and to view obstacles as opportunities for growth. Mental happiness is nurtured through practices like mindfulness, meditation, and cognitive behavioral techniques that train our minds to focus on the present and to engage with our thoughts and feelings in a healthy, constructive manner. Emotionally, happiness is the ability to experience and appreciate a wide range of feelings, including joy, gratitude, and love, while also having the resilience to endure and learn from sadness, frustration, and anger. Emotional well-being involves understanding and accepting our emotions. 
expressing them in healthy ways, and developing empathy and connections with others. It's about building relationships that provide support and fulfillment and learning to navigate the complexities of our emotional landscapes with awareness and compassion. Intellectually, happiness is stimulated by the pursuit of knowledge, creativity, and personal interests. It involves engaging our minds in learning new skills, solving problems, and exploring new ideas. Intellectual happiness comes from a place of curiosity and a desire with personal growth, leading us to seek out challenges that stretch our capabilities and to engage in lifelong learning. This dimension of happiness encourages us to find passion and purpose in our activities, contributing to a deeper sense of satisfaction and accomplishment. Understanding happiness as a combination of mental, emotional, and intellectual well-being expands our approach to seeking fulfillment. It shifts our focus from chasing ephemeral moments of pleasure to building a life that is rich in meaning, purpose, and joy. By nurturing each aspect of our well-being, we create a more resilient and adaptable foundation for happiness, one that allows us to embrace the full spectrum of human experience with openness and optimism. Chapter 1. The Foundation of Happiness The Importance of Self-Awareness and Mindfulness the significance of self-awareness and mindfulness in the quest for personal fulfillment and happiness cannot be overstated. These foundational components act as the bedrock upon which we build a life of contentment, resilience, and deep, meaningful engagement with the world around us. Self-awareness is the conscious knowledge of one's own character, feelings, motives, and desires. It is the first step toward understanding our thoughts, emotions and behaviors, allowing us to navigate our inner landscapes with clarity and intention. With self-awareness, we gain the ability to recognize our habitual patterns, strengths and areas for growth. This introspective insight enables us to make conscious choices that align with our true selves, rather than being driven by fleeting emotions and external pressures. It fosters a sense of authenticity and integrity in our actions, leading to a more fulfilling and genuine existence. Mindfulness, on the other hand, is the practice of being present and fully engaged with the moment, free from distraction or judgment. It involves paying attention to our thoughts, feelings, bodily sensations, and the environment around us with an attitude of kindness and curiosity. Mindfulness teaches us to observe our experiences without getting caught up in them providing a space between stimulus and response where choice and freedom lie. This practice helps reduce stress, enhance emotional regulation, and improve cognitive function, contributing to an overall sense of well-being. Together, self-awareness and mindfulness create a powerful toolkit for personal development. They allow us to live more consciously and intentionally, fostering a deeper connection to ourselves and others. Through self-awareness, we come to know our true desires and values, and mindfulness offers us the tools to live in accordance with those values, moment by moment. This alignment between who we are, what we value, and how we live our lives is essential for lasting happiness. Moreover, self-awareness and mindfulness contribute to our ability to navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. By understanding our internal triggers and reactions, we can approach difficult situations with a sense of calm and clarity, choosing responses that reflect our best selves. These practices also enhance our relationships as to cultivate empathy, patience, and open communication. In essence, the cultivation of self-awareness and mindfulness is not merely a personal endeavor, but a profound contribution to the greater good. By becoming more aware and present individuals, we contribute to a more compassionate, understanding, and mindful society. These practices offer a pathway not only to individual happiness, but to the collective well-being of our communities and the world at large. Chapter 2. Enriching the Mind Through Learning The Joy and Fulfillment Derived from Learning New Things The joy and fulfillment derived from learning new things are profound and multifaceted. 
touching every aspect of our lives and enriching our experiences in the world. This continuous journey of discovery not only feeds our natural curiosity, but also stimulates our minds, enhances our skills, and broadens our perspectives, contributing to a deeper sense of satisfaction and well-being. At the heart of learning lies the exhilaration of uncovering new knowledge, of connecting previously unrelated dots to form a more comprehensive understanding of the world around us. Each new piece of information acts as a spark, igniting our imagination and fueling our creativity. This process of learning is not just about accumulating facts. It's about expanding our capacity to think critically, to solve problems innovatively, and to approach challenges with enhanced insight and wisdom. Moreover, the act of learning new things fosters a sense of achievement and confidence. Mastering a new skill, whether it's a language, a musical instrument, or a technical competency, provides a tangible sense of progress that boosts our self-esteem and motivates us to set and pursue further goals. This cycle of learning and growing is a key driver of personal development, pushing us to transcend our limits and explore new horizons. Learning also plays a crucial role in our emotional and social well-being. It connects us with others who share our interests and passions, facilitating meaningful conversations and relationships. Through learning, we come to appreciate the diversity of human experience and thought, which fosters empathy and a deeper connection to the global community. Furthermore, the pursuit of knowledge keeps our minds active and engaged, which is vital for our mental health. It has been shown that lifelong learning can improve brain function, delay cognitive decline, and even contribute to a longer lifespan. The mental stimulation that comes from engaging with new ideas and challenges is as nourishing to the brain as physical exercise is to the body. The joy and fulfillment derived from learning new things remind us that we are never static beings, but rather evolving individuals in a constant state of becoming. This realization opens up a world of possibilities and encourages us to approach life with a sense of wonder and openness. Whether through formal education, self-directed study, or casual exploration of our interests, learning remains one of the most enriching and life-affirming paths we can take. Thank you for listening. You can get the complete ebook, Live Long and Prosper, Happiness Comes From Within, for free by clicking the link in the description below. Before you leave, hit the subscribe button, if you would, and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you and have a wonderful day.